YouTubers. This is the Apostle SF Smart here for you. Um, and I am coming off a crazy week. Uh, last week, I had a birthday, then an anniversary, and then a graduation to attend, which was uh, those of you who are subscribed, which I think is all of you, to uh, Andy Pliskin. It was his graduation that I attended uh, because my girlfriend goes to the same school. Um, yeah, there's not that whole actual family thing going on with, with Andy. We don't look that similar. I know, I know that you would think we're family, um, but we're not. So, um, by the way, if you don't, uh, if you're not subscribed to him, he's an awesome guy. Andy Pliskin is, is his new channel. Uh, his old one was John Pliskin. Subscribe to him. Great guy. Gotta watch his videos. Awesome. So, um, let's start with boop, 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 May 8th, my birthday. Um, I got the coolest thing for my girlfriend. Let me show you. Oops. Almost knocked over my breakfast. Richard Matheson. This is craziness. I didn't even know they sold these anymore. Uh, it says now a major motion picture at the top. But the funniest thing about that is they're not the same. They're as far as the East is from the West. These, excuse me, these two. Um, I am Legend of the Book and I am Legend of the Movie have three things in common. I think they've got the same name. They've got Robert Neville, and they've got vampires, and that's it. That's all they have in common. These are two completely different stories adapted from the same name. That's it. Um, it it's, I don't think they used Richard Matheson as a creative consultant or anything, um, because it's just so different, and uh, there's, there's absolutely no way. Um, actually, I read in last December an advanced copy of the script, and I did not know it at the time, but that was a lot closer to the book than, than this was. And I'm not one of those people that really likes to nitpick about how close it's going to be to the, to the book, or, or, oh, they didn't do exactly what I wanted, so of course it is crap. Why does that matter? It's entertainment. So, <laughs> so I was entertained by the movie thoroughly. Just like iRobot wasn't um, exact from the book. Uh, the Pursuit of Happiness. I'm naming Will Smith movies. Um, uh, Iron Man wasn't exactly from the comics. They changed it. Okay, that was more conducive to their environment. Um, but I'm starting to rant, and that's crazy. So, um... That was my birthday, May 8th, enjoyable. May 9th, my anniversary. I was actually not there, not in the place where um, Andy and, uh, and my girlfriend go to school. Uh, I keep saying my girlfriend. Her name's Sarah. I will call her that <laughs> now on. Um, yeah, they go, they go to the same school, um, and they... Uh, they had the same graduation. Makes sense. So, uh, I went there uh, that night, May 9th, and uh, two year anniversary. Uh, it was really cool. And I got her some stuff. Yeah. But it was a bunch of things, so they would go like for both, because I'm, I'm not getting her a million different things, because I don't have money to spread around. I'm a youth pastor. They don't pay me enough to do that. So, uh, for uh, anniversary and for graduation, really cool stuff. I'm not telling you what I got her. Ha. So, on Saturday, the 10th, was the, uh, the, uh, why can't I think of the name? The graduation uh, commencement ceremony. And it was long and drawn out. And the 
speaker was kind of funny, but he's old, so he found himself being boring without realizing it. <laughs> and uh, I have a tendency to do the same thing. Um, yeah, so that was that was really interesting thing. And then um, I had some dinner with um, with Sarah's family, and it was a really cool day. And uh, then Sunday for Mother's Day. Me and my mom had a, had a nice dinner. Um, well, the whole family was there, but it was for me, for my birthday, and for my mom. Um, and we had this really cool dinner, and it was awesome. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. So, oh, also, I'm working on my conference, Renegade. I'm trying to keep you guys updated on that. Um, it's, it's a really cool thing. Uh, I don't know, I was conceptualizing things. And um, it's purity, strength, um, worship, and um, women, for lack of a better term, uh, are the, the pillars of this year's conference or the different sessions. And uh, right now I'm looking for a creative consultant. Isn't that cool? <laughs> Little... 21 year old Samar is looking for a creative consultant for his renegade ministry con or conference ministry but <laughs> all that means is I need someone to organize my stuff I need to know what's happening every part of the day and I don't know how long things take like I don't know all the things and I don't have planning meetings and all this stuff because I'm 21 the most prestigious thing I've ever done is conduct a service in, in, a, in a church that boasts 150 people. You know, it's not a, not the hugest of, uh, of amounts. But um, I'm confident that this is going to be something that's going to keep going. So, uh, yeah. I do um, completely went blank just now. I don't think about what I'm going to say before I say it. So I don't know how many of you thought I do, but I don't. <laughs> um, Andy Pliskin does, though. Uh, but I have some souls because other people don't. But anyway, um, yeah, so that was Sunday. And then into this week, uh, I registered for school and stuff. But it, it, was, it was all really late notice. But, um, yeah, other than that, uh, if you guys have questions for me, ask me all about that, and that's all I've got, so, from this humble youth pastor out to all of YouTube land, find me at a later date, <laughs> oh, I love processed red and wheat, yeah, I'm filming.